Jeff Natale, and I'm uh, president of Erie Kids, and I'm coming to you with a president's vlog. And um, today I thought I'd talk about something that's a little bit different. Um, really, it's a uh, an idea that's been coming up an awful lot in therapy, and it's this idea of what I'll call psychological courage. And um, I guess a, maybe a, a layman's definition of psychological courage might be something like the idea of being able to uh, acknowledge and confront the issues that um, you struggle with in your life or that I struggle with in my life and uh, being uh, willing to um, courageously confront those things and um, kind of in a way that doesn't um, leave bits and pieces of information behind that we may be less um, willing to confront. So I really thought that it would be kind of neat uh, just to very briefly kind of go over three things that I thought were really valuable um, in terms of coming to a point in your life where you feel like you're ready to take a step in doing something um, courageous um, about a problem that you may have, whether it's a, a problem with your kids or a problem that you have yourself as a parent. And really the first um, issue is planning. And, and what I mean by planning is this idea of really kind of considering um, all of the things that um, you want to change about this particular issue and uh, looking at how those things, those problems, kind of infiltrate your life and uh, being able to see the bits and pieces, all the, all the um, sophisticated or fine uh, pieces in which that, that particular problem affects you. And uh, I think um, really it's kind of sitting down and doing some soul searching is the way to do that. The second issue is accounting for vulnerabilities. And what I mean by that is each of us have our own vulnerabilities in our lives. Um, things that we are short-sighted about or things that scare us or things that um, we're not proud of. And um, if we're going to be successful in um, being uh, psychologically courageous, we're going to be able, to, uh, we're going to need to be able to know really where our weakest parts are, so that we don't put ourselves in a bad situation that we really just can't get ourselves out of. And then finally, right before you put into effect what your plan is, um, or and I should say, even after you've put into effect your plan, is an honest review, and that is um, kind of the ability to really look at what you've done or what you're planning to do, and ask yourself, are you ready? Uh, did you do as well as you thought you would? Um, what parts of uh, your plan failed and what parts were successful? Because when it comes to psychological courage, it's not, and I might even go so far as to say psychological growth that comes from that courage, it's not any one time effort that's going to make uh, a major change in your life um, or in the lives of your children. It's going to be the consistent implementation of those efforts that are going to really make the difference. So, uh, a brief review. I thought it would be valuable. And as always, I invite you to contact me directly at uh, jeff at eriekids.com or you can visit us on our website, www.eriekids.com for lots of information about how to raise your children to be strong and uh, emotionally resilient. Thank you.